people. Yeah, I'm gonna start off right now. Um, <laughs> I'm Sydney. Amber. Caitlin. From Just Cause. Go ahead, your video. Okay, so this is my first video back. Um, that was my idea. We we're gonna say our most embarrassing story. Like, obviously, like some of us will like. I know Cindy has a, a story that like it's just like too like it's not inappropriate. It's just like disturbing. So she won't tell that one, but she'll find another one. Anybody who knows you well knows the story, and you are not to share it. I know you, Ingrid. Don't you dare. In the comments. <laughs> In the comments. Uh, so yeah, we're going to just share the most embarrassing stories of our, like, that, that we can remember. Because obviously there was plenty. Everyone has yeah. hundreds throughout their lifetime, but. Okay. Does anybody have this off the bat? I do. Um. Grade, I think seventh grade. I was walking down the stairs with all my books in my hand and my friend, um, and I was walking down, not up. I was walking down, and I fell down the stairs. Literally, that whole like trip and books fly and went <laughs> down the steps. Like hands, I was like this <laughs> trying to stop. <laughs> all of me not to cry like in that moment and like I was just like in shock books all the way down the step my friend ran down after the, the books <laughs> I'm like hello and then as I'm getting up or like turn around to like figure out how to get up there's my crush of the day <laughs> of the day like you've had multiple <laughs> well, not in the day but you know like back in the day that was the crush at the time and He's Wait, like, did he help? Oh, are you okay? Like, do you need anything? Like, do you need help? Like, it was uh, so awkward. I think he picked up my books, but I just got up because I didn't want to touch his hand. <laughs> but, um, yeah, that was quite embarrassing. I stood up, gathered my books. I was scraped everywhere because the stairs in my middle school had, like, they weren't just, what do you call that? Like, texture. It wasn't just, like, a plasticky type thing. It had um, sandpaper on oh, the see. edge, like literally on the oh, edge of each grips. Steps. Yes, I had <laughs> sandpaper <laughs> scrapes all over my legs and my hands and my arms. I was okay. beat up. <laughs> that all was right. the worst. All right. Well, I guess I'll go next. Mm -hmm. um, mine's recently um, at college, so I was gonna tell one from like first grade, but I'm like, let's do one recent. So, all right. This is like the first month of college, and um, I'm coming back from cheer. It is like eight o'clock at night, or like nine at that point. Um, we're coming back from cheer practice, and it was me, Sydney, and like four other cheer friends, and we were all going. Like it was a ten minute walk from the rec center, which is where we have um, practice, all the way back down to our dorms. And um, on the way to our dorms, we have to go like down like, this really long pathway to get to these obnoxious stairs, and they call them these horse stairs because. Apparently the length of like it takes for like a horse to get down them easily. So like it's either like for a normal human being you have to take like it's like one and a half steps, but then you have to like either like cut your yeah like, cut short or like go extend. Like I go one, one, two, one, one, two like, down and so it's so awkward. awkward. It's so awkward. So one day we're all hyped because it was such a good practice and we decided let's run down the stairs. And there's 29 steps, not 30, 29, yeah, 29. and so. we're running down, and I have my bag in my hand, I have my phone, uh, bag, bag in my back, phone in my hand, I was like, alright, let's go. We're all laughing, having fun, we start going down the stairs, and literally, on the third to last step, my foot, well, I like ran too fast at that point, and my foot like slipped down, like, off the edge of it, and like went down to the second one. And I missed, <laughs> I missed the I'm next two. I'm picturing that in my head. I was right minute. behind and I was like, and so I missed the next two steps. And I did like a, if you, <laughs> gymnastics terms, I did a dive roll all the way down. Like I missed the total, like pretty much the last three steps. Just like did a dive roll. I'm my head, like, <laughs> my head went first. I ended up having yeah. to um, put my arms on the ground. And, like I did like a total tuck and roll thing. And the, but the thing is like, I, I pulled it off so nice. I stood right back up and I was like, I'm good. But like, I had my hand, like, well, my phone in my hand. So like, I had done like this, like, I landed on my shoulder and on my, uh, wait, so it was my shoulder and my elbow. My elbow got scratched up and so did my knee. 
and like I did like this awkward like <laughs> roll, <laughs> and it was like a ninja roll that was a fail. And but I got up fine, and all of the girls were just like, "Are you okay?" This poor guy in front of us like turns around, sees her, and he's like, "Do I go back or do I continue?" Yeah, there's two forward. people in front of us, two guys, and I was just like, "Yeah, there you go." <laughs> all right, my turn. Eighth grade chorus rehearsals. You know this one. So, here's the thing. I woke up late this one morning. It was in the end of eighth grade. We were going on to high school and we were doing our chorus rehearsal during second period. And, you know, it was for the concert, like the end of your concert. And we were singing, like, a bunch of random songs. And I woke up that morning late and I had, like, no time to get breakfast. But, you know, like, breakfast is, like, an important part of the meal. But, like, I never liked breakfast foods or anything like that, so I just take like snacks, like Rice Krispie treats, like don't do that, but that's what I do, like costing brownies. Mm. But uh, mm. I decided to have six blueberries. <laughs> I you were gonna say six cosmic brownies. I was like, <laughs> six blueberries. That was my entire breakfast for the day. But here's the thing, I always had number because I always had like lunch later in the day, and I hated it because I I can't hold my food that long. Um, I always had like my emergency applesauce with me, mm -hmm. I and um, I always like kept a spoon and applesauce in my backpack just in case like if I were to go into gym class. Like we always had like two minutes to get changed, and I would just like just gobble that stuff up. So uh, we were in chorus rehearsals, and I was on the um, the stands. What are they called? Risers, the risers. I was on the risers. I was on the second thing of the risers, which I was so proud because my entire life I was small, but on the first step, I was like, oh, I'm on the second step. But, uh, yeah, so we we're on the risers, and, you know, six blueberries isn't going to hold you over that long. And it was like maybe an hour, an hour, an hour, an hour to the day already. And I was like, hmm, I don't feel good at all. And I have gym next. So as soon as we're done with this, I can go to gym, I can just gobble up some, you know, applesauce and be fine, be fine. So, we had to do like this whole like process of going out and back in to practice like getting onto the, the risers. So Amber and Giovanna were also at that rehearsal, I mean, everybody knows, of course, just the rehearsals, that's even more awkward. So, we're outside and I'm like, guys, I really don't feel well. Like, I, I just, I'm going to get sick if I don't get food. And they're like, just hold it and you're fine. So, we are singing this song called Contente Domino. And I don't I have the alto part probably. And I remember being right next to the piano and just feeling like that, just like dreadful, like all the lights are on top of you, so you're sweating and you already feel like you're like gonna die anyway. Cause I was just like <laughs> trying to hold myself in. I was probably like literally just like flushed and everything. I felt disgusting. People around me probably didn't realize because they don't really care about me, but you know. But I was just like Holding onto the panel but to hold myself up because that's how much like I was going to pass out, and you know in the middle of seeing Conte de Domino, we had to say Conte de Domino at the end, and I went Conte de Domino. <laughs> it was so perfect. And right in front of me, whom I threw up on, was a girl that had crutches and a boot on so she was kind of disabled at the moment and couldn't move and I got it all over her and she, she was a germaphobe so um, germaphobe disabled girl at that point um, did not appreciate me and it was like all like blueberry color and everything so I stained the carpet in our auditorium. Like, I don't know if they changed it yet. So happens when you're on a, your phone during a video, mm, especially an embarrassing video. <laughs> but um, <laughs> there's still maybe just like a purple blue stain right at the the stage because that's where I threw up. And I remember just like everyone seeing me because it's blueberries and like the inside of blueberries. <laughs> <laughs> It's, it's and so I was like, thinking about that. I was like, what color stage do you have? <laughs> <laughs> like that made it turn purple and blue. But yeah, it was all over the carpet, and that stuff's right out the carpet. Oh my god! And so I was just like, like in shock that I did that. Everyone was just like, oh, the girl who I threw up felt so bad. I'm so sorry for her. But uh, I just remember seeing my teacher, and I was like, can I, can I go to the nurse? Like, just, just. 
pop my way over to the nurse, and she's like, yes, yes, yes. And the nurse is like right outside of the auditorium, so I'm going up the aisle, and Amber's like, can I go with her? Because she's my sister, and she's literally saying this random girl I don't even know with me. And I was like, get my sister over here. So I'm going up the aisle, and you know, since I'm still like in shock, I'm still kind of throwing up, so I stop in the middle of the aisle, and I threw up again. I kept on going. There was this mother and her son coming into the school, and he was like coming for the first time he was transferring to the school or something like that. And I remember them being like, so this is our school, and I come out of the auditorium just throwing up. <sighs> and I was like, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. And I just like went to the nurse, and I, kind of, I, I barely threw up in there, and I was like, yeah, I just like threw up a couple times in the hallway. She's like, go to, go to the bathroom right away, right away. And oh god, I was just so embarrassed. Oh my god. Yeah, yeah so nice. I'm the girl that created the purple stain on the carpet. <laughs> so there you go. Those are uh, embarrassing stories. I don't know if I've ever heard that one. Really? It, it's so yeah. Ooh. Or I'm brain dead. I've had two concussions, people, so. Uh. They tell me a lot. I'd be surprised if she didn't tell me. I'm, I'm a talker, as you guys already But know. I'm kind of surprised that I don't remember, too, <laughs> if she did. Anyway, Ow. feel free to share your own stories in the comments. We love to read them. Cool. We're always reading the comments. We are. We, we, I promise you, we do. We may not respond to some of them, but, like, you know, we do read them. Yeah. You guys were super nice in that oh, last I video. Oh, right. The, I don't know when we're going to post this, but we just posted the update, update video a couple yeah. days ago. And you guys were super nice about that. I mean, yes, you guys kept on saying, like, bring back the burping. I... Guys, this is not a burping channel. Burps are in the videos. Like we're if, not afraid to burp. But, but the thing is, you have to watch the videos if you want to see the burp. We're not going to tell you there's a burp in there. You just got to you got to wait and watch them. There might not be a burp. There might, be not, might not always be at a the video. Yeah. Either. Yeah. Wait, we usually put them at the end for the bloopers, but they might not always be there. I can yeah. guarantee they'll probably be in the burping contest, but I don't know when. But it, yeah, it's not all about the burps. Yeah, it's not. Even That's though it's not cool. what it was meant for. Mm -hmm. It was just... That just happened to be the video that got the Yeah. Views. Something that came to mind and they wanted to film it. Yeah. yeah. So... So there you go. Well, I hope you guys like this video and we'll see you next time. Um, this is Sydney, Amber, and Caitlin from Just, just Cause. Cause. Bye. Are you sure it's recorded? There's a red dot. Yeah. Shouldn't the red dot be blinking now? Bloopers. Shouldn't? No. Are you sure? Yeah. Okay. Jesus. It'll have a pause, a green pause. Gotcha.